Hello everyone. Welcome to Flamingo Trans World. My name is Vioma. In this fast times, the world has become too small. People have started traveling a lot either for business or tourist or leisure or medical purposes. Many a times you must be confused about which airline to choose, how to choose, which route to choose. What is the difference between economy and premium economy, business class and first class, direct flights or via flights? Here is the answer to all your confusions. Hello everybody. My name is Pooja Bhatt. What is an airline hub? An airline hub is an airport where a particular airline offers a myriad to direct flights allowing the passengers to transfer to connecting flights to their final destination. What are booking classes? Generally airline have different classes like economy class, premier economy class, business class and first class economy. There are different type of classes in economy and that we get lower to higher. In lower class we get refundable fares, non-refundable fares and not changeable fares also. There are more seats in economy class. Premier economy. Some airline have premier economy. In that we get little more leg space than the normal economy class. Business class. Every airline have their own business class. They have around 20 to 40 maximum seats in business class. It has less seats with more comfort like flat bed, bigger TV screen, different meal options than economy class. Business class is superior to economy class but less expensive than the first class. Intended especially for the people traveling on business. First class. Lots of airlines have first class cabin. They have generally 15 to 20 seats in first class. We have privacy like separate cabin with lot of options of meal and drink and flat beds as well. Other A380 operates like Emirates also have a suite like first class with the similar amenities but the bed and chair are integrated where a button is pushed on to turn the seat into a bed in seconds and vice versa. Etihad Airways introduced a three-room suite called The Residence in December 2014 when it added the Airbus A380 to its fleet. What is seat pitch and legroom? Seat pitch is the exact point-to-point -point distance between two seats. The seat pitch in economy class is 30 to 32 inches approx. What is frequent flyer program? A frequent flyer program is a loyalty program offered by an airline. Just we have to enroll the program online to accumulate the points which may redeem for air travel or other rewards. Airline give cards like this. We can redeem it on partner airlines also. What is the choice of airlines from Ahmedabad? There are a lot of choice of airlines from Ahmedabad like Air India, Jet Airways, Emirates, Qatar Airways, Etihad Airways, Singapore Airlines and Kuwait Airways low-cost carrier called LCC in that airline gave us only seats in lower fare. Other things like baggage allowance, meals in flight, seat request, all other is chargeable. SpiceJet, Fly Dubai, Air Arabia, Indigo, Go Airways are got low-cost carriers. What meals can you get in flight? There are a lot of different types of meals in flight like Asian vegetarian meal, Jain meal, non-vegetarian meal, Muslim meal, seafood, child meal, fruit platter, diabetic meal, low calorie meal, low salt meal and many more. What are the different type of entertainment systems on flight? Movies, TV shows, music and games in different languages and we can also enroute the journey on flight and we can also shop on board. What is health requirement boarding? Health regulations. Airlines have different rules and regulations for health. We need to have valid certificates of vaccination may be required in certain countries. This information may be obtained from the local health authorities in your departure city. Medication. We need to have a medical prescription or a note if you are carrying a needle or a syringe because of a medical reason. If we need to dispose of a used syringe or needle, you need to take a permission from a cabin crew while on board the craft. Medical clearance. As a guide, Singapore Airlines requires a medical clearance from a Singapore Airlines appointed doctor when a fitness to travel is in doubt. As evidenced by recent illness, hospitalization, injury, surgery or instability. Medical clearance is also required in cases that require special attention 
or the use of special medical equipments on board, for example, use of a stretcher, supplementary oxygen tank, or similar type of medical equipment. The objectives of medical clearance are to provide safe, healthy travel, and high levels of customer. When in doubt, please consult your medical practitioner or fitness to travel. If medical clearance is required, please print a copy of the Singapore Airlines medical information from MEDIF and fax the completed form to the nearest Singapore Airline office. Alternatively, you can also obtain the form from any of our appointed travel agents or from any Singapore Airline office. Please note that there may be a delay in obtaining the medical clearance if the information provided is incomplete. Hence, it is advisable that you inform us of your travel plans early. Wheelchair and mask. Almost all airlines provide wheelchair service at the airport till ramp. But we should have valid reason for the same. And we also have to carry wheelchair certificate from a registered consultant. Mask. Some airlines are providing meat and assist service at the airport. We can ask assistance when we travel with an infant or we have the language problem. Some of the airlines are charging for the same. Flights within Europe, USA, Australia, Southeast, Africa and China. Flights within Europe. When we talk about internal travel in Europe, we can fly on Air Baltic, Air Berlin, Blue Air, Blue Express, Brussels Airlines, EasyJet, Flybe, German Wings, Iberian Express, Jet Airfly, Norwegian, Pegasus, Ryanair, Smart Wings, and many more. Flights within USA. And if we travel to USA, we can fly internal USA on Alaska Airlines, American Airlines, Delta Airlines, Frontier Airlines, JetBlue Airways, Southwest Airlines, United Airlines, Virgin America, and many more. Flights within Australia. Same way, when we travel to Australia internally, we can take flights like Qantas Airways, Jet Airways, Virgin Australia International. Flight within Southeast countries. When we travel to Southeast countries internally, we can take Jetstar, Sleek Air, Garuda Indonesia, Air Asia, Scoot Airways, Bangkok Airways, Malindo Airlines, Malaysia Airlines, and many more. Flights within Africa. When we fly in Africa, we can take flights like Air Algeria, Air Botswana, Congo Airlines, Egypt Air, Ethiopian Airlines, and many more. Now we talk about China. We can fly internal China on Shanghai Airlines, China Eastern Airlines, Air China, Shenzhen Airlines, Xiamen Airlines, Shandong Airlines, Beijing Capital Airlines, China Southern Airlines, and many more. There are different rules for all airlines for baggage. In weight concept, generally in economy class, baggage allowance is 20 to 30 kgs and above. In premium economy class, baggage allowance is 30 to 40 kgs and above. In business class, 30 to 40 kgs and above. In first class, in suites, 40 to 50 kgs and above. Now, second is peace concept, which is applicable from flight to and from the US and Canada. Again, all airlines have different rules. In economy and premium class, some airlines allow one piece of 23 kgs and some of the airlines allow two pieces of 23 kgs each. What are non-refundable and refundable tickets? Non-refundable tickets are always cheaper than the refundable tickets. And after issuing these tickets, we cannot get any refund if we cancel these tickets. Because of some issue, it is totally non-refundable. We cannot get single penny. Refundable. Refundable ticket airfare is little higher than non-refundable tickets. How many types of aircrafts are there? There are many types of aircrafts, but here we present some. First is Boeing 777 is the world's largest twin jet aircraft of Boeing company. It is capacity of 281 to 440 passengers. Second is the Airbus A380 is a double deck wide body aircraft of Airbus company. It can carry almost 480 to 656 capacity of passengers. Embraer 190 jet 94 to 106 capacity of passengers. It is the Boeing 787 Dreamliner, is a long range, mid-size wide body, it weighs in seat 242 to 335 passengers. There are different types of taxes. Every taxes have their own two-letter codes. User Development Fees, IN, Development Fees, YM, Service Tax, JN, Fuel Surcharge, YQ, Career Imposed Miscellaneous Fees, YR, Passenger Service Fees, WO, Swachh Bharat says F2. When any passenger misbehaves on board or with the crew, then at that point of time, pilot is the king. We have to follow the instructions whichever is given by them. 
We hope you got all the details of the airlines from our side. Thank you so much.